What's up guys, Spinfire Arms here, and this is my stock Glock 19. Now there's one non-stock internal, which is a Ghost Avenger connector, but they run beautifully. I have three of them in other Glocks, never a single issue. Anyways, this has a pretty high round count on it, pretty beat up, but I love this thing. Ameriglow iDot sights, my second favorite sight picture. I absolutely love them, and I have about 20 different sight pictures for Glocks um, at my house, and these are number two, so that says a lot. Anyways, Handle Edge Series grips, mill spin base plate i try to go over all these things because i always get questions so i try to help you guys out in advance and i ordered my holster i got a beltless iwb holster for it from blacksmith tactical can't wait to get it in i'm going to be carrying it this winter love this setup right here especially when you're going out like last night we went to a an outdoor event for christmas for the kids and stuff a lot of people and it's in the city so I, had, I, I would have rocked something like this. I didn't have a holster though, so I just brought my 43X to the light and my Glock 20, or and my Shield Plus for a backup. Anyways, TLR7A by Streamlight. Oh yeah, and also you can use code SPN for 10% off all Blacksmith Tactical holsters. That's what I run for all my firearms. As long as they make it for a firearm, I'm gonna be running my firearm with it. Anyways, so I'm not a big firearm light person, for everyday carry, um, I get why people carry them. I, on my home defense, they have lights. But for everyday carry, I haven't carried with a light a lot. Are there some times where you should be carrying with a light? Yes, of course. But if I'm out in daytime, I'm not gonna carry it around the extra weight, the extra mass. It's not a ton, but I just don't feel it's necess necessary for daytime carry. But at all times, I do have a firearm with a light ready to go um, for when it is dark out. Anyways. This light right here is so impressive. Now I have a TLR6 on my Glock 26, um, my 43, 43X, and so on. And I have a Warrior Land Tactical um, on my SIG P365XL, and none of those lights compare to this thing. This thing is so bright, so amazing. I like that it doesn't come out past the slide and barrel. Um, I don't like lights that come out to here. I already don't like long bear or four inch. I like three and a half inch and shorter barrels on my firearms just because of comfort wise. Being a man, appendix carry, I want something smaller, less bulky, less mass. But honestly, when you pick up this setup right here, the weight is evenly distributed. It feels so good in the hand. I already love a Glock 19 Gen 3 with finger grooves. Finger grooves just fit my fingers perfectly. But also with that light, it just gives you a good feel, very natural point of aim. I love it. It didn't affect this firearm at all for me putting it on there. Now, what is nice about this is the buttons to turn it on. On the TLR6, sometimes I find myself not reaching far enough to press the button, which tends to be out here. On this, the button is right here. Very easy, and it's on both sides. Righties and lefties can do it. It is amazing. Such an easy button to press, but it won't accidentally turn on for any reason. It's just put in the perfect spot. You don't have to expend, extend your finger too far out. You don't. The biggest thing is you don't have to change your grip on your firearm to turn the light on because it's just right there. It's a real easy click, um, and I love that about it. That's why I'm very impressed with this light. Very happy I got it. It's absolutely awesome. Um, and that's probably one of my main complaints about other lights is where that button is. But on this, this is an awesome first light that has that button. First experience with a light like this, and it's definitely winning me over. I love it. Small, compact, awesome buttons in a great place. Very, very bright on top of that. I forgot how many lumens it is. It doesn't matter to me though. This light is so bright. I don't care the number. You can see anything. It'll light up my whole floor, first floor. Um, it's amazing. I love it. This is a great light. Um, I'm not a big light guy though, so you can only take my review of it with a grain of salt, but compared to other lights I've shot with or other people's lights I've used, this is the best light that I've seen and it's awesome and it comes in at a reasonable price. Anyways, thanks for watching guys.